everybody, and welcome back to the Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire Soul Link Randomized Nuzlocke Redo here on the channel. I am the Medieval Massacre, and I am joined, of course, by my partner in crime and Pokemon, Mr. Craven Gaming. Craven! How's it going, everybody, and welcome back to episode number five. Oh, we're on episode number five. And uh, don't be fooled by our Slateport location. We have still yet to beat the Doofer Gym. Yep, and you wonder what? I'm going to start this one off pretty early with something because we forgot to do it in the last episode. Question of the day. Because we missed one, I'm going to give you guys two. First off, because of this episode. We made a big deal about it being number five. What's your guys' favorite number? Ooh. Do you have a lucky number or do you just have a number that tickles your fancy? I mean, I, I do have a lucky... Like, I have a favorite number. Oh, what's your favorite number? 100% it is the number 2. Ooh, I know, why? It's, it's like a weird why? number, but I believe everything's better in pairs. I mean, that's also your OCD talking. That is also my OCD talking, because it's an even split. So... Right. And, of course, Soul Links. Yeah, Hell there's yeah. two of us. Right, yeah, hey. Uh, uh yeah. Yeah. I don't necessarily have one. I like giving smart-ass responses every time someone asks, you know, so they'll be like, oh, what's your favorite number? I'll be like, 3.14159. Oh, yeah. Just just to be a shit, which is pi for those who don't know. Oh, yeah, most just, people know. Well, people are like, oh, it's 3.14 or 3.142. I'm a smart-ass, I'll go further. Yeah. Uh, but trying to think about it, you know, there's the default 7 that a lot of people go to, which... Sevens are fun. Sevens are okay. Uh, sometimes I say 92 because let's place a number on me, that's the year I was born. Uh, of course, 42, the answer to life, the universe, and 42, everything. the... The Univorce. The Univorce. Uh, but try and think of, like, a genuine answer. 69, dudes! <laughs> Without having my head in the fucking gutter, <laughs> I got nothing. I don't think I really have one. Yo, so... guys, tell Craven in the comment section below what his lucky number should be and why. Yeah, convince me of a favorite number. <laughs> I have no lucky number, change my mind. Yeah, which is funny because uh, Shady actually did something like that because he's like, uh, I don't remember. What the uh, what his question was, but it was basically like, convince me that I'm like, convince me to change my mind. Which I'm like, hey, that's actually kind of cool. <clears throat> yeah. So, but for the last episode, uh, right before we hit record, we were talking about epic rap battles of history. If you guys never watched those before, what are you doing? Pause this video, go watch a few. Yeah, but then, but then come back to this video because it's, it's gonna be hot. Yeah. Revenue, come on. All two cents. Let's go. Uh, but what's your favorite? And there's 70 episodes. It's 70! <laughs> Is it okay if I say a spin-off that's not actually an epic rap battle? Like, it's, no. it's not by them. No. It has oh, to be fuck. by them. Yeah. Sorry. Dog, it has been so long I have no idea. Honestly, one of my favorite ones is either, um... The Wright Brothers vs. the Mario Brothers, or the one of the ones that I still always hold there is Albert Einstein vs. Stephen Hawking. Oh, shit. I think that one might be my favorite. Because that has some of the best lines and puns that you could do. Yeah. It may not be the most savage, because um, Gandhi vs. Martin Luther King Jr. was incredible. Yes. But just... E, e, uh, that means Albert E equals MC squared is an amazing line. Yeah. Anyways, enough of that. So we're here still in Slateport just because we're going to get an encounter. Because if you missed the last episode, go back and watch it because stuff happened. Yeah, uh, spoilers incoming. Three, two, one. I fucking lost a Bagon. And yes, yeah. I said Bagon. Bagon. So, but this is my encounter first, and I shall uh, pull up my uh, old rod. And... Yo, I forgot you can get an encounter there. I'm doing it, like, right above the beach. <laughs> <laughs> what the actual... 
actual fuck. Oh god, if you get a fucking retina. <laughs> oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. People are texting me. It's incredibly professional. Part of me hope you could get a fucking male retinas, because that would literally be an exact replacement. Dog, I fucking hope so too. You got hypnosis too. What is this broken bitch shit? Oh my god, that's hilarious. Come, yo, I've come got on, this thing give has me my nips. have one more. Fuck. Yeah, you don't want to lose Spectre right now. I really don't. Oh man, and he's got it. I've got a Pokemon on the hook. Uh, it's not a Rattata. I don't mind having it on my team, though. What is it? It's a Laron. Ooh. Can't use him. Why not? Everybody. Oh. Well, shit. I mean, that's... Look. 90% of the point of this pair was hilarity. Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. I like that. I mean, you took fucking Light Fury from me, so... Good careful nature. Oh, no, you know what? Uh, this is my dude, Girder. You call the thing Girder? I called it Girder. Just, uh, G-U-R-D-U-R? Uh, no, G-E-R-T-E-R. -E -E like a steel girder. To be fair, I've never had to spell the word before in my life. Oh, uh, well. Sounds like a U problem. I mean, right, yeah. Well, we've got a new pair. Uh, we can't use it. Oh, so back to Newford. And let's do the fucking gym. Oh, God. I know that Livewire is technically, 18. um, technically one level higher than- No, actually, they're the same level. Okay, Livewire's going up front because it needs some switch training. And also still my favorite thing to do in this gym is this. Oh yeah! Dog, I completely forgot about that. The one that taught you about that too. Yeah. Okay, starting us, off, starting us off the Marowak spine curve. Oh god, you're level 14. Marowak. Why the fuck are you level 14? Okay, fuck you. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm fighting this Vigoroth right now, and he's also level 14. I think it's because it's the only mod that she has, though. I'm hoping so, because... Goddamn, don't come after my life. Level 14 Omnite. Oh, shit. You know what, man? It's gonna be a nice challenge. We're on par. There's a Charmander. I guess I don't need Curse. Yo, get bubbled, Charmander. Okay, yeah, level 12, because you... Alright, yeah, you're fucking normal type. Oh. Wow, oh, you lived the confusion. Giraffe. Oh, claw. Yes, Katie? No kidding. And then we're gonna go back out to the claw. Up. Yo, kill this thing, please. Horsey? You can take a Up. horsey. Let's go. Um, that's those three done. I'm gonna go back and, of course, heal again. Dude, my nose is a fountain of nasal fluid. That's a sentence I don't think I ever needed to hear before in my life. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's because my room is so cold. But like... But just the term nasal fluid, I'm like, what the yo, fuck is wrong with the nasal fluid. So yeah, I'm here at Brawly. Waiting for you? Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm here. So, uh, who placed Roxanne? Do we remember this? No. <laughs> no. I feel like it was me. 
No, probably not because. Dude, don't take know. this. Just take this right now. Who voices the dad? I think that was me. No, or is that you? Because of fools. Fools! Uh, okay, uh, so work backwards from there. Because you always voice Flannery, right? I always voice Flannery because she's my favorite gym leader. Okay, before Flannery is who? Watson. So Watson's me, so that this is you. Well, there's, there's really only one voice you can give to a guy that's on a fucking island. Uh, yeah, that's right. Waka from Final Fantasy. <laughs> Happy Festival Fireworks, yeah? <laughs> I was just gonna be like, you know, in fucking New Yorker. Just oh, to be a I shit. thought you were just gonna go with like, ah, oh, dude. Like, I was, I was being funny. It's uh, called a joke. Laugh. Yeah, I know. You have to be funny first. Ouch. Come on, my life. <laughs> I'm Brawly, dude's gym leader. I've been churned in the rough waves of these parts, dude. I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanted to challenge me, bra? Let's see what you're made of. Okay, so obviously we don't speed this up because it is an important battle. Cowabunga, uh, my dude, Arthur Marshall. Okay. This is, I guess, just how we're starting. Um... Why, what's on your screen? A Groudon. Ah! Yeah! Seems like you need something that has a kick. Uh, I mean, I don't know how that would help me. He is a ground type. Fighting is good against ground, and he's heavy AF. He's heavy AF. That is the one part of what you said that is correct. I'm pretty fucking confident fighting is good against ground. I'm aware of your confidence, and I, I do like that you have it. And again, this is coming from you who forgets type effectiveness. So... You literally forget type effectiveness all the time. Ha! Sure. <laughs> Charmeleon and Magby. Fucking come at me. See, I just have to hope right now that uh, he doesn't get the ancient power boost. Oh, he has ancient power. Uh, because if he gets the ancient power boost, I pretty much say goodbye to my entire team. So long, thanks for all the fish. Uh, let's go for a bubble. I know that it's going to be... Oh. Uh, Fighting is neutral. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. I mean, to me, it just it would make sense if it was weak against it. I mean, why? Have you ever punched the floor before? Well, because I'm thinking of, like, you know, people breaking bricks in half and shit, right? Well, yeah, but bricks isn't, like, the ground. Bricks are man-made. Mm -hmm. That's why fighting is super effective against rock. Tug, I'm sorry, but Gengar, as much as it's an amazing Pokemon in this gen, is Cheeks. Oh, yeah, until the physical special split, Gengar's pretty terrible. Oh, a, an ember from a Magby did 12 points of damage. And heal. This is why I went and got all those fucking soda pops. Oh, yeah, I got soda pops too. I got 12 of them. I think I've got 21. I mean, I wanted to buy balls. Because, you know, catching that ganger. <laughs> yeah. I mean, so, uh, how's, how, you how's your fight? How's, how's your fight? Uh, you know. You know. It's Groudon's, going... like, handing me my ass. And I can't speed up, so I'm just kind of... Open and pray. Oh god, I went for Vice Grip. Why did I go for Vice Grip? Why are you continuing to lower my fucking speed, bro? I'm not outspeeding you. The sunlight never stops being strong, right? I mean, now I wait for you. Yeah, yeah, you do. I'm casualty free. 
Uh, you know what I'm not free from? This Groudon? Uh, well, number one, this Groudon, and number two, my timer. But my timer is 100% on, and we've, we're, we're good. I've got two Hardens up. So, Ancient Power and Mudshot are not doing as much as they could be. Oh, my face is all full of sniffles. And now he has officially used a Super Potion, which means I am speeding up. Because <laughs> otherwise, we are going to be on this fight until fucking D-Day. Yeah, and that would take a long time. And, oh my god, he fucking used it again. He used the second one? He used the second one. God damn. Really? Okay, okay, really? okay. <laughs> He's dead. Apologies, I had to speed that up. Now he's going to use a dragon air. Really? I mean, probably a little, at least a little bit easier to kill than a fucking Groudon. Yeah, but also, man. There's there's two different types of people, right? <laughs> there's, there's the one that with has you. Charmeleons your... and Magbees. <laughs> and then Groudons and dragon airs. And then Groudons and dragon airs. Oh, man. That's okay. The sunlight is still strong, so that makes me feel good. Also, busting? Busting makes me feel good? Fucking Thunder Wave, really? I mean, this is how you won things with Dragonair back in the day. Yeah. Thunder, Thunder Wave, Wave rap. Because that's the only thing I was good for. Or, in this guy's case, Thunder Wave Twister but he never flinched me once. So... We win! Yay! Oh, Let me know God. when you get to this part of the dialogue. Fuck. <clears throat> Wait for it, we got the Knuckle Badge! From Brawl. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. The Knuckle Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in trades, obey without question, brah. And you'll be able to use the HM move Flash outside of battle. If you like, you can use this technical machine too. I'm surprised I said technical. <laughs> Be fucking proud of me, bro. A TMOA contains Spit Up. Which normally contains Bulk Up. Up, up, and away. Oh, and... He doesn't explain yours because it's not that for you. A oh, mine is Destiny Bond. Yeah. Uh, as some people would say, money. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, first off, I'm gonna heal. Because I don't know if I'm gonna I'm run into a trainer. First off, I'm heading Because I've already faced all the fucking trainers, so I could just yeet. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and slip slide up into this mart. And, uh, get the fuck rid of you. That's back up to 4,600, which I'm gonna use this to buy seven more gr uh, no, no. Six more girls. I'm gonna fight children. Holy fuck, it's a Kyogre! Wow. And Livewire's dead. Wow. Two. Fucking piece of shit. Three. I mean, at least it was to a Kyogre. Yeah, but also, piece of shit. I'm gonna go fucking bury Livewire, who has done actually nothing for me, and... I hope someone fucks his corpse back to life. I mean, that's hey, back-to-back back that, episodes, buddy. you awesome thing. You don't get a light ball, because you didn't want to evolve into a Pikachu. I tried to show you love, motherfucker! I mean, do we fucking go to Route 110? Yo, do we fight this fucking Lickitung? I think we fucking do! Uh. Yo, 
Get Next fucked, like it's on. Oh, ugly ass. Uh, can't do that either. Wow, we literally can't add any of these fucking teams. Why? No, because water look at all types. those water types. Uh, yeah, Route 110. Uh, fuck yeah. This is you. Yeah. I'm getting right in there. Right into the fucking thick of it. And we're gonna pull out this soul rock. That's rock type. That's a rock type. That's at least a new type, depending on what I fucking get. Soul rock has no gender, does it? Uh, nope. Mm. Gonna continue uh, the joke. Nickname this thing Lunatone. So you got a rock named Lunatone? I do. I mean, it's got Levitate and it's got Confusion, so I've got my Psychic type back. I am trying real hard. To see the bright side, but man, it is difficult. Sometimes I forget you don't have a filter on your channel. I really don't. Okay, so I'm gonna slip slide. Yeah. Slip and oh, yeah. slide. It's Up a new pair, this. and we don't have a poison type, and we don't have a fucking carrot rock type. Up into this, uh, arbor house looking thing, and talk to this balding fuck. Come on, Do balding we... fuck. I'm guessing we're adding this to our team. I mean, we might as well. Let's go. Oh, okay, we're not voicing this guy. Neat. Yeah. I fuck with him. We only gotta talk to him one time. Uh, yeah, but he's plot. Now, we are about to get the TM for Thief. Yep, and I wish that we didn't have 50 bucks, because then they'd let us in for free. Yeah, oh, TM for Substitute. Watch me walk the fuck out of here and immediately go sell that shit. Barrier. I'm not gonna sell it because I don't want to waste another 50 bucks. Oh, look at me. Wasted another 50 bucks. Yeah, because I had less money than you. Alright, you know, I'm I switch training to limit so if I run into anyone. something that has shadow tag, uh, fuck me and fuck everything. <laughs> yes, if you're looking for a start, that would be me. Ah, that must be the part I ordered from Mr. Stone of Devon. Thank you. That's great. We can prepare for our expedition now. Who's that? Uh, who wants to be the grunts this time? I mean, I'm taking Stern, so you might as well. So how can we fuse pirates with land dwellers? <laughs> <laughs> uh, speak in pirate talk, but do it like. Like a, a normal gentleman. voice. So, like British pirate. Yes. How the fuck do you laugh as a British person? <laughs> ah, he, ah, he. <laughs> Hold it. We'll take those parts. What? Who are you people? We're Team Makwa. Our boss wants those parts, so shut your yap and fork them over. Battle. Yeah, I don't know what this voice is. Cyclist Wellington, you are definitely British. Right? Yeah, he got dicked pretty hard. Yeah, because we can speed this up. Oh Great. yeah, 100%. Great. I mean, the one good thing is that I have Sludge. 
I mean, Sludge is good. Oh man, what a disaster. The boss is going to be furious. See, with your characters, they at least have power talk. Mine, none. Hmm, Sniveling Wimp, let me take care of this. The dialogue has been the exact same. Oh wow. Cyclist Donna. Entrepreneur Marilyn and his fucking pigeon. Yo, okay. Okay, Eddie, you're not a fairy type. I wish you were. Yeah, I learned rock throw. Cool. You good? Uh, not yet. Wow. Dog, I think, I I think you might need there. to get good. Uh, yeah, my Lunatone is at level 15 now, so I believe I've gotten good. Go ahead. Now what? If we don't get those parts, we're in for it. Arg. That's, that's, that's me being a pirate. Arg. Arg! I do say. I, I do say shiver me timbers. I didn't Swamp count on being metal. deck and all that. I didn't count on being meddled by with some meddling kid. Metal, metal, metal. Go ahead, take Marchy. Okay. I came by to see what was taking so long to snatch some parts. And you simps are being held up by a mere child? I am Team Agma's Marchy. Tell me, why do you meddle in the noble affairs of Team Magua? Heh. <laughs> This is where our dialogue changes. Yes, because now he starts going on about the sea. Pokemon, people, all life depends on the sea or the land, depending on which game you're playing. So Team Magma, uh, Team Agma is dedicated to the expansion of the sea or the world's landmass. Don't you agree? What we're doing is a magnificent undertaking. Nah, fine, you're still too young. It can't be helped that you do not understand our ideals. But if you ever oppose us again, there will be consequences. Heed my warning, farewell. Ah, oh, sorry. You're... Ah, okay, you're a bunch of fools. Anyway, that was a tense situation. Thank you for saving us. Oh yes, I almost forgot that you even brought the parts from Devon. <laughs> that's... Oh, there's no time to lose. We have to set out on our ocean floor expedition really soon. Thanks and excuse me. Lang 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 lang. Well, I mean, I leveled up. I got a rock throw. Uh, we did some cool things, and in the next episode, we're gonna get some new encounters. Yay! So if you guys like this episode, finally make that like button your bitch and follow us on Twitter at time for a massacre That's a numerical four. It's linked in the description below. You can also follow Craven at the Craven Gaming, also linked in the description below. But until next time, I'm the Needle Massacre for myself and Craven Gaming, and that's the 411.